The Yellowstone National Park region has experienced three massive eruptions in Earth's history. The biggest of these major caldera-forming eruptions occurred 2.1 million years ago and resulted in 2,450 cubic kilometers of material ejected, earning its supervolcano status in the world. The Yellowstone National Park welcomes nearly 3 million visitors a year. Most flock to the area to take in a stunning natural landscape that includes the Old Faithful Geyser and a plethora of hiking trails, mountain peaks and hot springs. That's not to mention the variety of wildlife that call the park in the home. Below the surface of this outdoors person's paradise lurks another natural wonder, however, one that has the potential to wipe the park off the map. The Yellowstone supervolcano is a massive source of granitic magma that rests miles under the park's surface. The Yellowstone supervolcano is a massive volcanic system beneath the national park. It is one of the largest active volcanic systems in the world. The Yellowstone supervolcano has an enormous caldera, a large crater formed after a massive eruption empties the magma chamber beneath the surface. The Yellowstone supervolcano has erupted multiple times in its history, with three major eruptions over the past 2.1 million years. Huckleberry Ridge eruption, approximately 2.1 million years ago. This was the largest eruption, producing the Huckleberry Ridge Tuff and creating the first massive caldera. Mesa Falls eruption, approximately 1.3 million years ago. A smaller eruption compared to the others, it produced the Mesa Falls Tuff. Lava Creek eruption, approximately 631,000 years ago. The most recent super eruption, it created the current Yellowstone caldera and produced the Lava Creek Tuff. The eruption of Yellowstone supervolcano isn't the end of the human race. Mike Poland, scientist in charge of the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory, writes, most Yellowstone eruptions do not fit this worst-case scenario. 